Hogan and Delanga put Glamorgan on top on day one. Leicestershire suffered a tough defeat to Durham in their last game. Their opponents Glamorgan also lost in their last match and were eager for a good start at Grace Road. Leicestershire got the early advantage, winning the toss and electing to bat. Horton showed good intent early on, but was then trapped in front by van der Guten in the seventh over of the morning, out for seven. With the very next ball, van der Guten had his second wicket, Ackerman caught by Hogan for a golden duck. The following over, Carberry was sent on his way by Hogan, and Leicestershire were in real trouble. New batsmen Cosgrove and Javid looked to steady the ship, but the Glamorgan attack had their tails up and it wasn't long before the visitors had their fourth wicket. Cosgrove trapped in front by Delanger for 14. That brought Dexter to the crease and he played sensibly in an attempt to rebuild things for the hosts, but his partner Javid soon fell victim to Lloyd, caught behind for 13. A tough morning for the hosts and things didn't get much better for them as the afternoon session got underway. Rain was bowled by Hogan for two. It looked as though it was going to be another difficult session for Leicestershire, but new batsman Parkinson batted well alongside Dexter and the pair protected their wickets and took the score past 100. Parkinson was growing in confidence. He reached 30 before Hogan eventually got the breakthrough, Selman with the catch. In came Hill and he batted well as Dexter pushed on, the partnership lasting till T, the score 174 for 7 at the break. A good session for the hosts after being 62 for 5 at lunch. With Dexter well set on 76 not out, Glamorgan came out for the evening session eager for the remaining wicket. And it didn't take long, first Delanger removing Hill for 13. New batsman Aaron failed to score before becoming Delanger's third victim and Dexter was running out of partners. The following over, Salter brought the innings to an end. Dexter caught by Murphy for 87, Leicestershire all out for 191. A good performance by Glamorgan, Hogan and Delanger, the standout bowlers finishing with three wickets apiece. And after a quick change of innings, Selman and Murphy got Glamorgan's reply underway. The pair played well as they formed a solid foundation. Leicestershire's bowling was tight, but the Glamorgan pair batted sensibly as they gradually took the opening stand past 50. They saw play through to stumps, 82 without loss the score at the close, Selman 39 not out, Murphy unbeaten on 32. Glamorgan will resume on day two, trailing by 109 with all their first innings wickets intact.